Uh, I'm fascinated by the mobile application, but it's not surprising considering Providence is walking the walk in so many other areas. Can you tell us a little bit more about that mobile application? Is it something that somebody like me could just download and start using today? Uh, absolutely. It's called Virgin Pulse, and it helps you measure everything from the benefit that you're getting out from your workout to how well you feel inside from a, a wellness perspective. And so it really covers the ground of mental, emotional, financial, and physical health. Um, to provide a holistic set of things that you can help manage on your own. With our own caregivers, we can have it fast, cheap, and better than we've ever had it before, all three. That's great. So on that note, um, healthcare hasn't traditionally been remote or home-based. And so how are, are those factors impacting um, your talent recruitment and your talent management? Well, as I, I mentioned earlier, we know that the 25 huge geographic hubs are going to be where the majority of the job growth happens. And that's going to have a massive impact on some of our hardest hit areas, our rural areas where we currently have critical access hospitals. And so we're investing a lot of money, not just in things like telehealth, where you might have a doctor in Idaho providing uh, virtual care to somebody in uh, Valdez, Alaska, sure. um, one of our ministries. Um, but we're also doing that within our administrative uh, areas. We're actually testing right now, for instance, uh, telecoaching for leaders. So that if you're a leader in Valdez and you don't have an HR professional sitting next to you, that yeah. you can do some telecoaching or tele-ER um, in ways that okay. um, we're deploying as well. So we're really trying to prepare for um, being able to get talent in these kind of 25 big hubs, um, but also to continue providing great care, whether it's for our patients and communities or whether it's for our leaders and our caregivers within our organization using teleservices.